Hi folks, Dr. Ed Beyer here. Now today I want to also talk about constipation and your thyroid hormone, okay? A lot of people don't understand your thyroid hormone has a great impact on how well your gut works. And here's how. When you're under active thyroid, and believe me, there's like over a couple dozen reasons why your thyroid may not be working very well, and I give a whole workshop on that too, but there's many, many reasons. If it's under active, what happens is, is the vagus nerve, which is the highway between your brainstem and your gut, will not function at 100%. Your vagus nerve depends upon your thyroid hormone to work. Also, our gut has its own separate nervous system. It's called the enteric nervous system. And that nervous system also is dependent upon proper thyroid function. So this nervous system and your vagus nerve will not work properly with underactive thyroid. And when, when you have less activation of the enteric nervous system and vagus nerve, you're going to get decreased gut motility. The gut doesn't work right. This is why constipation is a really common symptom with underactive thyroid. Also, you will have a decrease in stomach acid production causing bloating because you're not breaking down your food quick enough and sometimes the acids you do have will push up. Yes, acid reflux is almost always due to too little acids causing bloating and the pushing up of the acid that you have. Now both of these are going to cause a condition known as small intestinal bacterial overgrowth which is where the, the gut uh, bacteria will overgrow in the small intestine and that causes decreased absorption of your nutrients and your thyroid hormone that you may be taking. So a lot of times I see that patients will be on thyroid hormone and their levels aren't doing very well because they're not absorbing it. I'm Dr. Byer, have a great day.